there's a decrease Praise to you in peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ I thank my God in all my remembrance of you Always offering prayer with joy in my every prayer for you all In view of your participation in the gospel From the first day until now For I am confident of this very thing That he who began a good work in you Will perfect it until the day of Christ Jesus For it is only right for me to feel this way about you all Because I have you in my heart since both in my imprisonment and in the defense and confirmation of the gospel You all are partakers of grace with me For God is my witness How I long for you all with the affection of Christ Jesus And this I pray That your love may abound still more and more In real knowledge and all discernment So that you may approve the things that are excellent In order to be sincere and blameless until the day of Christ Having been filled with the fruit of righteousness Which comes through Jesus Christ To the glory and praise of God Now I want you to know, brethren That my circumstances have turned out For the greater progress of the gospel So that my imprisonment In the cause of Christ Has become well known Throughout the whole Praetorian Guard And to everyone else And then most of the brethren Trusting in the Lord because of my imprisonment Have far more courage to speak the word of God without fear Some to be sure are preaching Christ even from envy and strife But some also from goodwill The latter do it out of love Knowing that I am appointed for the defense of the gospel Before I proclaim Christ out of selfish, selfish ambition Rather than for the defense of the gospel Before I proclaim Christ out of selfish ambition Rather than from pure motives Thinking to cause me distress in my imprisonment What then? Only that in every way Whether in pretense or in truth Christ in Christ is proclaimed And in this I rejoice, yes And I will rejoice oh, oh, oh. For I know that this will turn out for my deliverance through your prayers And the provision of the Spirit of Jesus Christ According to my earnest expectation and hope That I will not be put to shame in anything But that with all boldness Christ will even now as always Be exalted in my body Whether by life or by death For to me to live is Christ And to die is gain But if I am to live on in the flesh this will mean fruitful labor for me And I do not know which to choose But I am hard pressed from both directions Having the desire to depart and be with Christ For that is very much better Yet to remain on in the flesh is more necessary for your sake Thanks to this I know that I will remain And continue with you all for your progress and joy in the faith So that your proud confidence in me May abound in Christ Jesus through my coming to you again Conduct yourselves in a manner worthy of the gospel of Christ So that whether I come and see you or remain absent I will hear of you that you are standing firm in one spirit With one mind striving together for the faith of the gospel In no way along by your opponents which is a sign of destruction for them But of salvation for you And not to from God For to you it has been granted for Christ's sake Not only to believe in Him But also to suffer for His sake Experiencing the same conflict Which you saw in me And now here to be in me 